Hey everybody, welcome to my channel. Um, I'm going to be doing a review on uh, Viper Tech. It's a uh, stun gun. Uh, I think it's really good for anybody that loves stun guns and different colors. Uh, I'll show you just in a minute what this looks like. Uh, I think this is good for women or men, either one. It don't really matter. Uh, if you're going out and you're jogging or you're walking or you a uh, female that's got small kids and you don't want to carry a gun, uh, sometimes, you know, this is a, a less lethal option that you've got if you happen to be running or jogging. It's just, you know, it's something to have to help. And also, sometimes, it you know, it does scare dogs off every once in a while because of the sound of it. So I'm going to show you what this looks like. Let me open this up. And it comes wrapped up real nice. Comes in its own nylon case. Let me move this thing out of the way. Um, comes in a real nice case. And you've got a belt holder. So you can put it on your belt. What I like about this is you can fit this whole thing in the palm of your hand. So open this up and I got the purple one. Because my wife likes purple so I bought her this one. So Viper Tech is the name of the brand. It's really light made. It's it feels pretty durable, but it is light made. Um, and I want to show you that on the very bottom, you push this out and you charge it up like that. I wouldn't charge it maybe four hours at a time. Um, that way you don't have to take the batteries in and out. And they already come like, you know, on the very bottom of it. This feels kind of. Uh, cheap made where you push this out and push it back in on the very bottom if you can see that so if you turn this on to begin with you got your little flashlight it's a it's okay for a for what it is for a flashlight I mean you can see to get out of your vehicle or it don't give out like a whole whole lot of light but to be able to see to put your keys in the car or in your house on the door, anything like that, that helps. I mean, it's it's bright enough for me. It, I'd say your cell phone's probably a whole lot brighter on the, the light than this is, but this does show up pretty good. So when you flip this up again, you've got a light that comes on. That means it's activated. It's armed. So... If you're running and you got this off and you've got this in your hand, you can pretty much conceal it like that. If you need the flashlight, you go up one time. If you go up one more time, you've got it activated. And if you push this button right here. And I mean, that packs... It packs a little bit of a punch. So I just wanted to do a review on it. Like I said, it is uh, it is lightweight. Uh, from what I can tell, the cheapest part of it is on the bottom down here that pushes this, pushes this out. Um, that would be my only concern is this, this little low gadget down here that pushes this out for you to charge it into the wall. The rest of it feels actually pretty good. Um, but that's my review so far on it. Uh, like I said, just to have something cheap. I mean, if you break this, guys, if, I'm going to put a link down in the very bottom. Uh, if you want to order these, um, I do have an affiliate link, so I'll put it on the bottom. Anything that you buy, I will make a commission off of it. It won't be very much. Um, like I said, these are on the cheaper side. These are on the cheaper brand. You can get more expensive ones that are um, are built real are built better uh, they may last a whole lot longer but for the price 
if you're just going to take this out while you're jogging or walking and something that you can just fit in this little tiny case and keep with you um, for the price I think you can get this for like 10 bucks um, and that's with free shipping and handling so you're not out a whole lot of money in case something happens to it um, but let me know in the comments what you think. If you want one of these, I'm going to put a link down below. It'll probably be a long link. Uh, but if you're interested in a stun gun, you can get these in purple, black, pink. I'm not sure exactly what all um, the colors that they do have. But, I mean, for what it's worth, I think that everyone that's a female or somebody with kids or, you know, anybody that don't even want to carry a gun... Uh, should at least have a taser or pepper spray, uh, something to protect yourself. Um, the way 2020 is getting right now, I think everybody should be carrying something. Um, it's just, it's getting that dangerous out there. Um, people are getting mugged, people are getting shot. Um, it's like people uh, in 2020 don't really care anymore, so... Anyway, I appreciate you coming to my video. I uh, hope you hit like. Um, if you want to subscribe, that's that's fine. That's up to you if you want to do that. I'm not, um, you know, on here jumping to make a whole lot of re. I mean, a whole lot of uh, subscriptions on here. If you you know feel like you're being pushed into it, but I wanted to just get a review on this and let you know what I think about it. Um, all in all, I like it. Uh, like I said, the only part that I do not like is on the very bottom. Um, I think this is just a little bit cheap made. Um, but you just have to be careful with this. Other than that, I think it's a, a pretty good stun gun for, for what it costs. Thank you for coming to my channel. Um, if you do want to order one of these, I'll put a link below and just see what you think and go through there. If this is something that you don't feel like you like, um, get on there and try to find something. Um, pepper spray, you know, uh, a rape whistle, um, pepper, I mean, uh, you can find these a little bit more expensive. Some of them's like 30, 40, 50 bucks, but for 10 bucks, I don't think you can beat that. And, uh, I'll see you next time. If I get any more, I'll get a do another review and hope to see you soon thank you for watching